I'm Scott Cousins, editor of the Frankfurt Times, and these are some of the stories you'll see in Saturday's paper. The Clinton County Courthouse shut down Friday after high levels of carbon monoxide were detected throughout the building. Employees were evacuated and the building closed around 10 a.m. No one became seriously ill due to the carbon monoxide, according to Commissioner Skip Evans, who added that the closure did, however, cause issues for candidates wishing to file before the noon deadline for the May primary election. February and March are taxing times of the year, but the volunteers with the AARP Tax Aid Program were busy Thursday making it a little easier for some of those people. The program, which provides free tax preparation to low- and middle-income families and the elderly, kicked off Wednesday at Wesley Manor by appointment and the next day at the Neighborhood Center for walk-ins. Two Indianapolis men arrested Thursday in Clinton County could face federal drug charges following a two-month investigation by five cooperating law enforcement agencies. Yvonne Alvarez, 32, and Ascension Sanchez, 22, were arrested by the Frankfurt Police Department on allegations of dealing cocaine and methamphetamine. Authorities confiscated about 25,000 worth of the drugs when the arrests were made at the BP gas station on Indiana 28, just off Interstate 65, according to a press release by the city. And finally, more than four decades ago, Mike Beck got his start in the wastewater business in Indiana and then moved up the ranks around the country for work ever since. Today, he's back in Indiana in Frankfurt. For these stories and more, buy a copy of Saturday's Frankfurt Times or visit ftimes.com. Again, I am Scott Cousins, and thank you.